Hi, so in this video we will install RabbitMQ on localhost windows. So let's get started. So first of all, before we install the direct RabbitMQ, we need an Erlang on our machine. So let's go to the install for windows. Download Windows Installer. Now let's open. Until it's get installed, let's install rabbit mq for windows Let's go to down and download RabbitMQ server. Let's open. Click yes. So both prompt come one allow access and allow access. So now if you go to the localhost one five six seven two, it won't work for now. We have to enable some plugin. So go to the so now let's go to the RabbitMQ folder and if I go to the C program files RabbitMQ server and the plugin is RabbitMQ management this one so what we'll do we will we'll go to the folder spin and go to the command prompt rabbitmq plugin Enable RabbitMQ Management Allow access I guess we have to use I guess hyphen should be not be there it should work okay there's an hyphen issue so let's try to see in the browser again okay we have to go to the service and we have to restart now let's see now it should work so you have to 
enable the plugin and then restart the server yes it's working default username and password are guest guest and it's all day so that's it uh, for windows we will also see the installation um, using the docker and then kubernetes as well in the coming section thanks for watching see you in the next video